Hey guys, Nash here back with another video. Today we are going to review .OS 2.2. It's based on latest Android 8.1. Now I previously reviewed this room when it was based on Nougat and now it's based on Oreo. And I must say this is the most beautiful room I have ever seen. So let's get started. So for this video I'm going to use my Redmi Note 4 but don't worry this room is available for many phones and this is the kind of home screen you get from very first boot. Nice wallpaper with custom icons and google swipe right feature. You won't find any unnecessary junk apps in this room. As you can see it comes with latest security patch of May 5. And if you go to setting menu you will see it's already themed to look like Android P. And here you will find two tabs. The first tab is called .us center where you find pre-installed theme engine by this room and the second tab is called .extras where you find all the features and customization. Here you find everything from status bar to quick setting to lock screen customization, pretty much all the features that you require in a custom room. So if you are looking for features like resurrection remix room, you won't be disappointed with this room. Apart from these features, in the display settings you get ambient display gestures where you can wave your hand on proximity sensor and you see all your notification. Now this is a quite useful feature, especially it saves your battery life. One more thing you find here is called .os wallpaper app, it has some seriously dope wallpapers. And despite of having these many features, this room is quite smooth. All the games are running smoothly, no lag or anything, all the animations are quite slick also. Now let's talk about battery life. I got 7 hours of screen on time with stock kernel. So you know on this channel we don't like anything stock. So I'm going to install custom kernel to boost my battery life. Comment below and let me know which custom kernel you want to see with this room. When it comes to camera, this room has below average EOSP camera but I'm going to install Gcam and if you don't know how to install Gcam, you can find that video in i button. On the good side, this room supports OT updates so you don't need to worry about updating the room, especially when Android P will be released. And as I said, this is the most beautiful room I have ever seen and you will find this when you are using this room. I mean in every corner on this room, you will find they have added some dope unique design. So the main question here is that should you flash this room, is it worth daily driver? Yes guys, it is a worth daily driver room, if you flash this room, maybe you will stick to this room for a couple of months. So with that outstanding boot animation and this detailed design in this room, I am going to give 4.5 out of 5. So I hope you enjoyed this video, if you did don't forget to like this video if you appreciate my work on this channel. This is your friend Ness signing out and I will see you tomorrow. Ooh.